Last week was pretty eventful. I'm glad you guys got to see Combo Breaker. It's pretty intense, right? And I'm glad the individuals who are watching this get to see the gains, the growth of esports as a whole. Now, we're not going to, you know, traveling all over the place for shits and giggles. We have a motive of what we're trying to do. And the main motive is cash is king. Cash for us is everything. And we have to get that infusion of capital to be able to sustain a website. So when we're going out to these events, we're basically talking to individuals that are gamers, tournament hosts. So therefore, when we do release, we can be able to have a great percentage of growth. Therefore, it can be more attractive to investors, which means we can be able to give up less equity in the company. And then the investor has to go with less risk. Uh, by investing inside of the company. The cool thing is that we've been able to build this product without any investment. That's awesome. Now we have to be able to prove the product at the same sense. And this is not inexpensive. I've been with startups in San Francisco where they've raised one to $15 million. So you can only imagine how much it costs to just build a product. At the end of the day, you gotta worry about staff, you gotta worry about time, you gotta worry about servers, you gotta worry about advertisement, things like that. Right now, what you guys are seeing is organic growth, and I really value that organic growth. And you know, but you can only go so far with this. So when we actually plan to release, it's in a sense of we need to be able to gain the investment to help us sustain uh, the growth that comes with it. And that comes with talking to a lot of individuals, especially from the investor standpoint. I do a lot of research. I know about Walt Disney. I know about Tom Livingston. These individuals go on to investor, 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 and investor without any success. Yeah, they're successful now, but that time between getting those investors was long. We can possibly be going out to market and we might not get any investors. So therefore, our runway gets depleted very quickly and we might have to shut the site down. That's the reality about going and the risk that's associated with the technology business. It's not you know, an easy road. There's a lot of money that's involved inside of these web applications and you have to be strategic about the motions that you go about. So I hope that it provides you some, with some real perspective. Um, we have a lot of events coming up. You know, we're going to be going to Anaheim. We're going to be in San Francisco in the coming days. So, I hope to be able to provide a great vlog to you guys to kind of lighten it up as this was pretty intense, but that's naturally how development is, uh, especially when you're trying to create something that's amazing. So I'll see you guys next week. Enjoy the vlog.